I have really long arms. Start the video. <laughs> Hey yo everyone, Blake's here, welcome to another video on Ao Blakester, and right now we're about to check out another underrated girl group. Last video I reacted to CLC, now this video we're gonna react to Dream Catcher. So yeah, this is their latest comeback track, Deja Vu, and a little history about me and Dream Catcher is that I actually did check out their debut on my own, and I actually wasn't really a huge fan of, you know, their debut, at least the style of music, at least at that time. But I actually did check out their last comeback, which was Petey, I believe. And that song actually really did grab my attention. Again, I checked out that on my own, so this is going to be my first time reacting to Dreamcatcher on this channel. And I'm actually really starting to think about reacting to all these different underrated groups. So if you guys want me to check out anything else from Dreamcatcher or anything else from any other underrated girl groups just let me know in the comments down below so without further ado let's check out deja vu all right y'all deja vu so i pretty much know what to expect knowing Dreamcatcher's past sound but then again it could be completely different so here we go three two one hit the playback oh okay okay i'm already seeing the dark concepts that they're known for Dark yet strong. Go ahead. Oh, she's sitting on a throne, queen. <laughs> and I hear just how big of an international audience they have, so. Ooh. And I have seen them on a few variety shows here and there, little clips, so they're pretty funny. Okay. Oh. Drawing a sword? Is she gonna like knight her or is she gonna. What? I'm mesmerized. Okay, there it is. There's that rock sound. I just remember their debut music video having a really hard rock sound, and I wasn't feeling it at the time, but... Hey, it's what makes them really distinctive, and I really applaud them for that. I'm really digging the artistry in this video. What? She disappeared? I'm definitely sure there's some s deeper symbolism in this that I'm not picking up. Now she's doing it to her. Okay. I love the CGI in the back with the clouds and the thunder. It makes it look that much more epic. Bunch of blue roses. <laughs> I'm sorry, just... I like the rock sound in the chorus, though. Like, not as hard as what I remember in their absolute debut, at least as far as I recall, but... I feel like their sound has really evolved since then, since their debut, so... Again, if you want me to... Holy crap! The, the visuals in this video! Man, I definitely see why people say they're underrated now. But again, as I was saying, leave a comment down below if you want to check me to check out more Dreamcatcher, and I'll do a special video. Choreography on point. Dang! Send the curtains on fire. Oh, I cannot get over those visuals. And the butterflies. Like... Dude. Okay. 
I guess the comments aren't going to really matter now, because I'll probably end up checking them out anyway, but if, still leave a comment if you really want me to check them out. Alright, um, <laughs> first of all, I mean, the visuals, the visuals, the doggone visuals, like, uh, <laughs> I loved the visuals in that music video, not just the members, but just, like, of course the members, but the, the scenery, the CGI, the green screen, just everything they did that was that a sun and a moon, or was that two moons of different colors? Like, I do not know, like, the thunder and the clouds and the butterflies flying around and just all the, the visual effects in that music video, the fire, the... <laughs> dude. Dude, dude, dude. Seriously, after watching that, I feel like I have missed out a lot. Like... I mean, like I said, I only checked out their debut and then their last comeback, which their last comeback, like I said, did capture my attention a little bit. This definitely captured my attention, and I can totally see why Dreamcatcher considered an underrated group now. Like, how can you spend all that money, like, on those visuals, on the imagery, and create such music grand hard rock music is that and stuff like that, choreography on point of course, outfits on point, everything about that video was just breathtaking. How can you put all that effort into it and then not go anywhere? To me, I feel like, unfortunately, that's just the nature of K-pop, like, and the entertainment industry in general is that, you know, you could put as much effort into it to make yourself as different, make yourself as unique. Make yourself as catchy, relatable, just whatever as possible. But in the very end, what you really need to truly be a success is just that connection and, more importantly, that luck. And, I mean, Dreamcatcher, from what I see, they definitely have luck internationally. But in Korea, I don't think they, I mean, as far as I know, still very underrated and just I just I really hope that this comeback does something for them I'm noticing my face is pretty shiny because I lotioned up about a little while ago so that's why I'm rubbing it <laughs> anyways um <laughs> yeah um I definitely am gonna have to check out their previous stuff because I mean from their debut like I said for the third time I didn't really care that much for their debut but after hearing Petey and now Deja Vu, I definitely see that their sound has pretty much evolved since their debut. And I want to see how it's evolved. So do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button and leave a comment below that you want me to check out more Dreamcatcher. And if enough comments come about, then I will. And yeah, again, like I said, I'm thinking about checking out some other underrated girl groups. So leave a comment down below as well what other underrated girl group you want me to check out because I love me some girl groups. I mean, I love the ultimate girl group first and foremost, and then just about every other girl group in the K-pop scene. So, yeah. But yeah, anyways, these are just my opinions. What are your guys' opinions? Put it down in the comments down below, and yeah. This is Blakester, and you're watching Ayo Blakester. So until the next video drops, make sure and like, comment, and subscribe for more. Follow me on Twitter if you want to, link in the description as always, and y'all have a great day, God bless you, thank you for watching, and peace out, Vice Gods! Bye! <laughs>